Isn't ah, me, you didn't start. I didn't know it was going to be there, and I, I was really short. I told you the home menu would disappear, and then you can start. I didn't know it was going to be that short, and I didn't know there was going to be a jingle, and I'm sorry, but hi, and welcome to another episode of Tales of the Abyss. This is what means to be not allowed to be in charge. Just Shut like up. Cyril. <laughs> Do we have to go with the saving throw hurt, please? Yes, always. <laughs> Just like that, you know that episode where we're down at the docks and Cerule's Look, all like- no, we're not going there. If you want to know about that, you can go watch it later. It's but not right up now, yet. It's I, I'm just going to tell you now, I'm naming that specific episode Cerule's <laughs> Flaw. <laughs> you can just name it Cerule's Fault. Well, your flaw, because it's his, it's literally your character's flaw. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so um, Luke's being a pansy. We left the Tartarus. We got Ion back. Annis is missing. Guy showed the fuck up. Enter and the amazing guy. Am I the only Stop person guy. who heard Ignis oh, instead yeah. of Annis? And then Tyr awkwardly jumped in front of Luke because he couldn't kill someone. So they just took a nap and now scene. Master, are you writing in your diary again? Because it's kind of girly. <laughs> yeah, but not because I want to. It's because Mother and everyone else will get all worried if I don't. I'll help you! Huh? How the hell are you going to help? Mm, I know how to write in Sonic Alphabet. Alright, let's see it. The mm, um, eh, master called me Thing 30 times. 38 times. <laughs> A thing? You're not supposed to keep count! You made that 39. Hey, Ew. now we can read the tire. <laughs> Luke, wake up. It's time to get going. Are you alright to be moving around? Yes, thank you for your concern. Tear Guy and I will take up a triangle formation. You will stay in the center with Ion and defend yourself if necessary. Don't forget me! What? In other words, you don't have to fight, Luke. Come on, let's get going. Wait a minute! What is it? I'll fight too. Aren't you afraid of killing? Of course not! You shouldn't force yourself, Luke. I'm serious! I mean, okay, yeah, I'm a little scared, but if I have to fight to survive, then that's what I'll do. I'm not gonna hide in the corner. Ah. Are you so proud of me, Master? Would you shut up? <laughs> anyway, I've made up my mind. From now on, I fight. Without hesitation. To kill someone means to rob them of their future, even if it is to protect yourself. And it can earn you the hatred of others. Are you prepared to deal with that? Can you face that responsibility without running away, without making excuses? You said yourself you aren't killing people because you want to. I've made up my mind. I'm not here just to be a burden. I'm going to take responsibility, too. But... I don't see any problem with that. We'll give Luke a chance to show us his resolve. Just don't push yourself too hard, Luke. His eyes are shaking. He's trying not to cry. I never noticed that before. It's because it's on a bigger screen. 
Yeah. Kill or... Master, are you okay? Isn't it fighting wearing you down? Shut up! I said I'm fine! If it's kill or be killed, then damn it, I'm killing! End of story! You got that? <laughs> Hello. Well, you look like you're a crime. I hope Annis is alright. Yeah, it sounds like she fell from pretty high up. She'll be fine. This is Annis we're talking about. True. I can't imagine Annis not being safe. This Anna sounds pretty incredible. <laughs> she is indeed a very cute and perky little girl. Yeah, she's very dependable. Really? She didn't she sure didn't look it to me. Well, as they say, you can't always judge a book by its cover. Why does that sound like it's pointed at me? It's just your imagination, Luke. Anyway, enough chit chat for now. Shall we be going? Yes, let's go. <laughs> So why is everyone assuming this Annis girl is all right? <clears throat> oh, here's Saint Bina. Trying to make sure we actually save. Yeah. Party of four. Woo! Why are the Oracle Knights here? St. Bean is the closest city to the Tartarus. They probably expected us to stop here. For a Kinlaskin, you're certainly familiar with Malkuth geography, Guy. I like reading about vacation spots. Oh, I see. How nice. Kind of look. Well, I don't know what person's on it, but oh well. We're from Endgame. Uh, we're here to fulfill purchase order for food supplies. You may pass. I hate my job. There's one more wagon after this one. Yeah, yeah, just get out of my face. All right, bye. How convenient. We're going to stop the second one and hitch a ride, huh? Let's go back down the road toward Engave a little ways. Yes, let's. Hey, quit making plans without talking to me first! Grow up. Stop the wagon! What are those animals? Uh, lizard horse? Oh. Colonel Curtis. And you're Luke, was it? Sorry about this, but do you think you could hide us in your wagon? We'd like to enter St. Bina, but a group of malcontents, meh meh, malcontents chasing Phone Master Ion are guarding the entrance. Could we ask for your assistance? Goodness, my birthday score didn't say anything about something like this happening. Ah! Please. Okay, we owe you for the trouble we caused with all the mistaken thief nonsense. Hop in. Thank you. We're from Ongave. One wagon should have already arrived. Right. Go on in. Thank you. Whatever. Kill me. Well, this is where we part ways. Thank you for your help. Yes, thank you. Don't mention it. Take care now. So Annis is here, right? She's to meet us at the Malkuth military base. If she's still alive, that is. Do you really have to say things like that? Let's go. Very unsettling. Try not to do anything to draw the attention of the Oracle Knights. Luke. I know, I know! You don't have to tell me every little thing! Hmm? Hmm? She's already got you whipped, huh, Luke? Princess Natalia is going to be jealous. And she's like, what? <laughs> don't 
doesn't say stupid things. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Stop touching me, please! <laughs> Perhaps this journey will help Guy to overcome his phobia. Not if he keeps getting hugged like that. <laughs> Looks like we got him unnoticed. Good thing that woman was dri- Good thing that woman was driving the cart. Must be my lucky day. So now what? If we stick around for too long, they're bound to notice us. Indeed. I'm hoping we can collect some information here. But let's check up on Annis first. The plan was to meet her at the Malkuth base, right? Let's go! All right, so first, we're going to want to go to the eastern area. And in the first house on the left. There's a... There's a notebook. Ba -ba 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 -ba. You can now make sandwiches. Oh, uh, what's his face as an endless game, is he? Not the wonder, chef. How come I had to lose the election to that McGovern? I mean, it's in his name, but what the fuck? <laughs> I've gone... I've done... What? I've done far more for the people of St. Pina. <laughs> Grandpa says he's a really important person. He said that when everybody in St. Pina got sick, he cared them all. I did! I think he's just bullshitting. I can't tell if that's a guy that's a or a guy. Girl. It's true, a way that dad saved that. It's the fuck? It's true in the way that dad saved the Town. city. Town. Town. Blah. When the soul tree almost dried up, he was the only one who still had the usable store of. Herbs. 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 I mean, if you want to be British about it. <laughs> Lady. St. Bina depends on the soil tree for everything. Without the soil tree, flowers wouldn't grow nearly this well. And I saved everyone! <laughs> which is why I should have won the election! Whether it's in the governor's name or not! Yes, Dad. We know. Go to the eastern side and to the medicine shop in the back, just past the ladder. I'm a hero, goddammit! <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Izumi. I'm. Is that a guy? Or guy. A girl? Guy. Hmm. <clears throat> uh, I'm short on ingredients. Guess I'll have to go out and get them. Uh, you've been looking around a lot of different places, huh? Just look how you look. Uh, but, uh, that's not what I want. Um, I guess I'll just go get it myself. What the fuck are you talking about? What makes it tough is that you can't be certain you'll even get any. The the fuck are you talking about, dude? Uh, we need to get a gel base and we need to get a cotton. A jelly cotton? <laughs> that is not what he said. Doesn't look like we carried over our ingredient items. No. Well, so fuck. we're going to have to go out and find them. Maybe that's why we needed nine thousand grade. There was there wasn't an option to carry over our uh, ingredient items. Only the usable consumable items. Dang. That sucks. Well, we can't. Oh, Tyr oh, said, "Quick, that. hide! It's the Oracle Knights." Quick, hide! It's the Oracle Knights. Have you found Fallmaster Ion? It doesn't appear that he's entered Saint Bina. Can I go home already? 
Well, it seems someone's not doing their job. Those people with Ion are the ones who killed Mommy. My Liger friends told me. I'll never forgive them. <clears throat> what about that Phone Master Guardian they said was hanging around? He appears to have made contact with the Molkus military. But Molkus is saying it's classified and is refusing to provide any useful information. If I hadn't let that necromancer get the better of me, Alice would never have gotten away. I, <clears throat> I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> That's what I told you! The only one who can defeat that beastly jade is the elegant servant of the gods! The esteemed <laughs> member of the Oracle Knights! Six god generals! Yours truly, Dis the Rose! You mean Dis the Reaper? How is one so beautiful as myself a reaver and not a rose? <sighs> First of all, you're fucking annoying. Second of all, there's no point in dwelling on the past. What do we do now, Sink? Hey! Withdraw the troops from Endave and St. Bina. But... Your wound still hasn't healed. The necromancer almost killed you. Why don't you take a break? And besides, the only way for them to cross the border is through Kaitsur. If we stay here and antagonize the Malkuth military, it could spark a diplomatic incident. Hey! Stop ignoring me! So next comes deciding how to deal with them at Kaitsur. Close enough. Ouch. <laughs> Let's return to the Tartarus for now and consider matters there. Inform the troops. First division. Withdraw. Yes, sir! God damn it! Fucking finally! Did you say something? No, sir! Except that means you're still on job! <laughs> you're all just jealous of my intelligence and beauty! Whee! That chair makes no sense! <laughs> Damn, Largo survived. This is the first time I've seen- This is the first time I've seen the six god generals. Who are the six god generals? The executive officers of the Oracle Knights. But there were only five of them. There's Largo the Black Lion, Dist the Reaper, Sink the Tempest, Arietta the Wild, Legretta the Quick, and... Looks like the one missing was Ash the Bloody. The Vans' immediate subordinates. Master Vans? If the six god generals are taking action, then the one who's trying to cause a war is Van. <clears throat> the six god generals side with the Grand Ma <clears throat> Maestro. Mose is likely giving orders to Van. Grand Maestro <clears throat> Mose would never do something like this. <clears throat> Yeah, you keep saying that, but... My mission for the Grand Maestro is top secret, so I can't divulge any details. However, I assure you it is one of peace. Wait a minute! Master Van wouldn't try to cause a war either! It's just the sort of thing my brother might do. What are you saying? What about you, huh? How do we know you're not a spy working for that Moe's guy? Please, settle down. He's right. Now's not the time to be worried about Van or Moe's. Right now we have to get past the six god generals and prevent the war. Yeah. You're right. I'm sorry. Huh. I'm not accepting the apology of anyone who badmouths Master Van and Sammy is standing on the 3DS. No, oh, she's not. She was. Well, Why? She's trying to settle on Hannah's lap. <laughs> well, now that that's over, let's head for the base, shall we? You are unbelievable. Your Oracle Knights sure are acting like they want to start a war. It couldn't be 
but blah, 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 blah. It couldn't be by the Grand Maester's order. He only desires peace. Are you still trying to blame Master Van for this? Well, that's the only way everything makes sense. Calm down, both of you. The important thing is that we're escorting Phone Master Ion to Batacle to avert a war. And that the Oracle Knights are after him. Exactly. It may... <laughs> what are you doing, <coughs> child? What did she just do? I don't know. Mommy, put me down. Are you pain. holding her weird? Stop being a pain in the butt. Well, Mommy, I want attention and you're too busy looking at a device. Daddy is busy playing the game, which means you need to sit in my lap or not nobody's lap. What? Daddy's lap. No. Exactly. It may not be clear who is ultimately responsible, but one thing is certain. Oracle Knights will continue to attack until we reach Batacle. All I want is to go home. Alright, can I leave the city now? No. Yeah, have you settled? The base is inside the city. I just want to look around outside a little. <sighs> we need a thing, Jade. I would be tickled if anyone would enlighten me as to what this thing is. Well, Oops. One of them is cotton. Okay. What was the other one? Gel base. And a gel base. <clears throat> well, you did your best. Sammy. <laughs> Find the gel paste and search point one, which is. Ah! <laughs> <clears throat> Melodists. So, Tyr, you're not a scorer? Not exactly. Scorers are members of the Order of Lorelei who can use the seventh phone or. Sammy. <laughs> I use phonic hymns, so I'm a melodist. A melodist? Not too many of those these days, are there? Not lately, no, and they usually serve in a supporting role anyway. I like melodists, though. There's something pleasant and soothing about their songs. Granted, some songs are used to attack people, but they also sing healing songs. And I like your songs a lot, Tyr. They somehow seem very nostalgic. I miss that. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you. Oh. Well, now that you mention it, I guess she does have a good voice. Shame about the personality, though. <laughs> Stop staring- Stop glaring at me! <sighs> okay, can I please read my phone, cat? Uh, west of St. Bean across the river via bridge and head south along the coast. <clears throat> oh, we gotta go all the way to the coast. I don't like the side quests that have you walking halfway across the map. Eating up time. I'm there sorry. are a few of those. It's not your fault, it's the games. Are you up here because you're out of water, child? Well, I can't help you right now. Mm. You'll have to wait until after the show. Rest in peace. There's a search point. 
Now we have to wait for it to give us what we want. Hmm. Gel base! Hey, got in one. As for the other search point... Uh, follow the path south from St. Bina until you reach the bridge that's out, and go west. So now we walk all the way back. Well, you know what? This seems like a good thing to take care of on the next episode. See you guys yep. next time! Jenny. Sorry, I moved it so the cat wasn't... I know. Hey guys! Do you like our content? Do you want to support the show? Click the link in the description below to visit our donation page. All proceeds go towards new and better equipment and games you want to see us play. Everyone who donates will get a special shout out at the end of future videos, and we're currently working on setting up some special perks for you. If you don't want to donate, that's okay too. You can support us by subscribing and clicking that bell icon so you get notified whenever we put out a new video. A huge thank you to Kyle Sheridan for donating and helping to keep our show going. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode of Let's Voice Act Tales of the Abyss. If you want to watch the last episode, click the box on the left. Or if you want to listen to our fantasy journey of Dungeons and Dragons from our show called Saving Throw, then I suggest clicking the box on the right. So again, thanks for watching and see you next time. Janet?